guys welcome back to my channel it has been forever since I have <laughs> made a video um, but I did just want to come back I had toyed with maybe deleting my YouTube channel for a while but honestly it's I just don't have time to edit is the problem and the very little time that I have with my husband after my kids go to bed, it's just, it's a lot and it's hard to sacrifice that. So I guess I just in the end need to be more mindful and just find a system that works if I want to maybe at least get like a video up a week. Um, but anyways, I'm doing well. Um, just a quick recap. Um, if you're new to my channel, hello, thank you for coming here, especially since I haven't posted a video in a year. So my oldest Liam is now, I have, five kids um my oldest Liam is now nine can't even believe he'll be 10 next year um he is in third grade my next oldest will be eight he's seven right now but he'll be eight in nine days um which is also crazy to me he's in second grade and then I have twins that are that just turned six in December they are in kindergarten and I have my daughter Quinn who is now 14 14 um 21 months old she'll be 22 months on february 5th so i am still going to use this channel for a lot of weight watchers and weight loss um i'm kind of at the end of my weight loss journey um i've been kind of in maintenance mode forever i've used weight watchers to get back to my pre-pregnancy weight um but within the last like two years, I've really been focusing on um, weightlifting and more fit the fitness aspect of it. So I think my goals are a little bit different now. I definitely want to focus more on um, building muscle and not necessarily losing fat. I do still have fat I need to lose, but I'm not like super concerned about it, but I am still following WW and I'm in like weight loss mode. So I'd say right now I've I literally hover around one between 135 to 140. I'm probably a little higher end right now. I'd say like, I, th I weighed myself this morning and I was 137. So I haven't been eating the best the last like probably week and a half to 10 days. So I definitely have to reel that in. But anyways, I figured I would just kind of take you guys along with me for a what I eat in a day slash maybe just a day in the life. Um, so I am just gonna go into Target. I have to get a couple of things, just random things like household cleaning items. Super pumped about the new WW program. I have 20 points on the WW personal points program per day. Um, I'm going to have a venti brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso. That's like one thing that I always get at Starbucks. It is expensive. Honestly, it's like almost $7, which is insane. Um, I get it maybe like once a week, sometimes twice a week. And it's like my little treat for just making it through the day. <laughs> Um, so I'm going to have that at six points, which I was actually happy because it dropped three points since they switched to the new program. So I'm going to have that and I've had a banana today and I'm working on 40 ounces of water. Um, I got myself an iron flask and I really love it. It's huge and 64 ounces, but it's just so heavy and bulky to like carry with me on the day to day. So I would prefer my reduce. I like that it has a handle. It does fit in my cup holder down here in my car. So definitely trying to get better about <clears throat> drinking my water so anyways this is five minutes of just me babbling anyways that's what i'm doing that's where i'm going i will catch you guys when i eat something next okay so we are back in the car Still a target, however. <sighs> Quinn was kind of a monster that trip. But anyways, I got her a croissant and she whipped it out of the cart. So that was fun. She ate at least like half of it. So at least I didn't completely waste money. But anyways, yeah. That was like the most random target trip. I got a gallon of milk. I'll do a quick Target haul. Hold on. I spent $19 in Target, which I think is the cheapest I've ever spent. But 
Um, Quinn loves these little toothbrushes. They're like nice and soft. So I've been using those because she always wants to brush her teeth and I'm all for that. And then in addition, I get this training toothpaste. She loves the taste of it and thank goodness <laughs> it's safe if swallowed because she basically just drinks it. Um, and then the only other thing that I got, so I'm trying to do like little things here and there just to like upgrade our house or the look of it. Um, so I'm going for like black hardware pretty much throughout our whole house. So I got these um, shower hooks. So this holds the shower curtain. Right now, um, the one, this is for the, the boys, the kids bathroom essentially. Um, the boys have just like a stainless steel color one. Um, they already have hooks that look exactly like that. And then I have like a bar, but I need to get a black one. So I'll do that at one point, at some point soon. But um, the main purpose of my trip, my husband created this really nice like mud room board and batten area for us. So I got a bunch of paint swatches because we painted like the wall above the area, bare Swiss coffee and Honestly, it's just too white. You almost can't tell the contrast between, we have bare pure ultra white for the trim and contrasting wall color. It's just not there, doesn't look good. So anyways, um, there's just a lot happening in the parking lot right now and I'm really distracted. So I will talk to you guys later. So while I'm sitting here, I just remembered that when I was at Target, that's so weird, the windows the lighting from the windows washing me out. But when I was tracking my venti brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso, or when I typically track it, it's six points with the oat milk. Um, the place where I ordered mine today did not have oat milk, so I ended up having to get, or I opted to get non-fat milk. Um, so I just wanna show you how I figure out the points in the Starbucks app. Well, I use the Starbucks app for the nutrition facts and then I go into Weight Watchers and plug everything into just like the food builder. Um, so let me show you how I do that. Okay, so from the Starbucks website, it's just like, it's already a drink. It's under ice shake and espresso. So ice brown sugar, oat milk shake and espresso. So I click that. I got a venti, so that's there. And I already changed it, so non-fat milk, and then nothing else was specialized. So it has six pumps of brown sugar syrup. Oof, that's <laughs> a lot. Uh, cinnamon powder, tea, ice, and then, I mean, these are things you can specialize. So I didn't do anything else special. So here's the nutrition facts. And then let me go up here, I'm trying to do this. Okay, sorry about that. So. From the WW app, I get 20 points daily. Um, I believe that's my fresh 27 that I get weekly. Uh, I go to create, I'm gonna go to food, and then you can just enter everything in. So I just go between. So it did not change the points value, so that's good. So I'm just gonna track it as my venti brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso that I had already saved. So let's see. Let me see if I type in Starbucks and see. So go here and we're gonna say, I've been having this since breakfast and track. So there we go. And I shall continue to drink. I have to stir it up because the sugar, sugar syrup is <laughs> up all sinking to the bottom, but it's so good. If you haven't tried this yet, I definitely recommend it. Delish. Quinn just woke up, so I'm gonna go get her. She's usually very happy after her nap, so I'll show you. Look out, here she comes. But you'll never know Yeah, I can't tell her how I feel Because she has someone who makes her happy I'm a ghost in these walls Or at least I try to be Are you ready to get out? I go Yeah Are you hungry? Yeah, I'm hungry <laughs> Okay Cause I hope that I 
I'm not showing how I feel for her, but she won't feel the same for me. I've got this picture in my mind. It's just the two of us, just the two of us. But I know I have to try, try to let her go, because she won't be mine. I listen when she talks I watch her when she walks She's giving me these feelings that I've never felt before But she will never know That I love her so well She's with somebody else And I will have to let her go She will never know, na na Never know Alright, we got our pony back in action Careful. Are you talking to your, oh, don't touch the mirror. You want to shut off your light? Uh, what? <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah, you climb down? down. Yes. Down. Go ahead, shut off the light. Come on, yeah. I'll pick okay. up your blankies. This is one of the best baby purchases we made was this hatch nightlight. You can control it from your phone. All done. Good job. Okay. Can I have your hand? Oh, you want to go like this? Okay. Daddy. You want to go see Daddy? Uh, oh, Daddy. she wants her Daddy. Nothing there. <laughs> no idea why she did that. Oh, we have to put those clothes away. Hi. Come on, you cutie. You hungry? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Daddy. Hi, beautiful. Are there sweetio still in there? <laughs> She's like, <laughs> is it good? Mm. She's having a couple of pepperonis before we give her whatever I decide to make for lunch. I might check in with the boys. I'm gonna ask your brothers. Brady and Brody. Don't put all your toys down there. Secondly, what do you guys want for lunch? Mac and cheese? No. We're done. Don't join the white bug gloves. Just make sure you leave everything. Oh, what are you doing? I'm doing YouTube again. Are we in? Yeah, say hey guys. Hi guys. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna shut this. Okay. 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 Take, leave all your wet stuff there for a minute, and then I will hang it up. Uh, what did that plant do to you? I <laughs> It's not a flower. It's a plant.
guys. Oh, I forgot my, I guess I don't necessarily need my headphones now. Although I think I might want them. Um, this is the first time that I am going to be working out down in my basement in like a year plus. Um, so let me just show you what I've got going on. It's definitely primitive and I'm like literally in my basement. But we did clear away some things and I'm just going to show you what I got. Okay, so this is just an old dingy rug that we used to have upstairs in our toy room. The kids are just, they literally got it all gross and dirty. So we were like, well, we'll just put it downstairs in the basement. So I vacuumed it this afternoon just to get all like the nastiness out of it as much as I could. I mean, there's only so much I can do with this rug. I have a treadmill. I have an elliptical. My husband actually found, oh, sorry, I have something in my hand, but that black thing right there is actually a fan. Um, it was a, it was originally, I believe, $100, and it was at Bed Bath & Beyond, but it was the floor model, so he got it half off. It's literally still the basement. I got a bunch of stuff stored, um, but I'm glad I have this open space. And then I also have this mirror that I got just so I can look at my form while I'm lifting. Um, and... I have to take these out. I got for Christmas the Bowflex dumbbells. So clearly I've never used them before, but I'm very excited to give them a try. Oh, I should probably grab my booty bands as well. Yeah, I'm gonna go do that. So I'm actually not gonna grab my booty bands because I think I'm gonna do an arm workout today, but that means I have to unbox my Bowflex um, dumbbells. So let me do that. I'll actually set the camera up so you can watch this process. Okay, so I'm super excited to use these because they basically go in increments of 2.5. Well, they start at 5. That's the lightest. And then you can go 7.5, 10, all the way up to 52 and a half pounds. So I'm very excited to use these because I don't think I'm ever going to get to the point where I am <laughs> uh, curling 52 and a half pounds in each arm. But, you know, I don't know. Uh, these are really for my husband as well, but I'm very excited to use these too. Let's get working out. All right, so I am starting off. Sorry, I'm like half cut off. <laughs> um, I'm starting off on my elliptical, and I don't know if this is messing with the volume. Sorry, because I'm sticking my headphones in. But I'm actually excited because I'm using my tripod twofold to record, and I can actually watch like a Netflix program. So I'm going to do... 30 minutes on the elliptical with a 10 minute cool down and then I'm going to do an Alive by Whitney arm program. So let's do it. Me and my girl, we do cardio. I play like Mario, cause Jay likes to cardio. But that catch is party on. Okay guys, so I've decided that tonight I'm going to do an Alive by Whitney. Um, it is the, it's one of the at home programs because everything else requires well, not everything else, but um, a large portion of her workouts require cables, and I don't have any of those. Um, so I am going to do an at-home dumbbell superset, uh, dumbbell total body superset workout. It says it's only 20 minutes, so it should be quick. Um, but yeah, I, I you have to pay for the program, so I don't want to like film everything. I'll film a little bit just to show you a few exercises from the um, the workout. But again, it's not my program and I have to pay for it. So I don't think that's fair for me to share like the whole workout. Stay in 
This is a pathetic what I eat in a day. I literally have eaten nothing. I'm eating goldfish right now. Um, which no, I didn't track. So, you guys, I believe, I believe I have a recipe. I can link it um, down in the description box below. But this is my cheeseburger pie. Um, I'm actually gonna have two slices because I have 14 points left for the day after my coffee. Um, so I'm just going to put this on a plate all right so typically what i do is just heat these up so i used kodiak cake mix or the kodiak pancake mix to do this um it didn't really change the points or anything compared to the heart smart bisquick but it is added protein um so Typically I'd have one slice. I'm gonna have two because I've barely, like I said, eaten anything. I'm gonna pair it with probably, I'm not sure, some sort of vegetable. I'm thinking green beans because corn is now points for me um, because it's a starchy vegetable. And then I'm gonna do some sour cream. So I have to figure out the points on this. I wanna say it's like three points for two tablespoons. And I think I have low fat, cottage, uh, low fat sour cream in the fridge, so I'm gonna find that. But for now, I'm just gonna pop this in the microwave and we will take it from there. Okay, so I'm also gonna have this Del Monte fresh cut green beans. I eat the whole can. I literally just put it in a bowl and warm it up. And it is actually gain a point for eating vegetables, so. So I just drain them, put them all in, and then pop them into the microwave. So this is the cheeseburger pie. Now I calculated um, I can have four tablespoons of this for three smart points, and I'm gonna do that now. So two tablespoons is 30 grams, so I'm gonna measure out 60 grams right now. Or I should say way out. Here is my dinner. Again, this is cheeseburger pie. I do have a recipe video, which I will link in the description box down below. Super quick, super easy, highly recommend. Um, the one thing that I will say, and my husband has mentioned this as well, it is kind of a, it's dry. So I always pair it with sour cream. I feel like it just enhances the flavor, but you could actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't, I'm assuming you could like add Greek yogurt or you could add a little bit of like a Greek yogurt sour cream mix like into the meat while you're cooking it. I don't know, these are just ideas maybe to, to moisten it a little bit, so. Um, again, eight points for the two slices, four points per slice. The sour cream is 60 grams or four tablespoons for three points. It's the Daisy Light Sour Cream. So this is 11. And then here, I gain a point back. So technically this is 10, 10 points. Um, and then I'm going to assume, I didn't really track my goldfish consumption, but I will <laughs> plug in, I would say I probably had at least like 20 goldfish or so, maybe more. Um, so I'll plug that in and let you guys know. guys it is the end of the night I did plug in the goldfish into my app and it said that I I said I had 40 of the just normal 
Pepperidge Farm Cheddar Goldfish. So that said it was three points. One serving is 55 crackers. I know I didn't have that much, so I just estimated 40, so three points. And then that left me one point. So I'm gonna dip one point into my weeklies, and I'm gonna have, these are my absolute favorite. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you will see that I have this pretty much every night, um, and it's really like my little sweet treat while I'm watching TV, and it's perfect. And I was pleasantly surprised to find when the plan switched to personal points. These went down to only two points, so super pumped about that. Um, I also just took my vitamins. I refilled 40 more ounces of water, so I haven't done great with water today. I've only had 40 ounces of water and then my coffee, um, so I know I won't drink <laughs> all this upstairs in the bed, so definitely gotta work on my water, and I have to work on eating throughout the day. Um, that's something that I struggle with. I just get super busy and my coffee kind of holds me over until like lunch, even like mid afternoon, three, four o'clock. And then I don't want to eat too close to when I work out because then like you just feel heavy and bloated and you know. So yes, I need to spread my meals out a little bit better. And those are my takeaways from today. Otherwise, I think it was a good day. It was the first time that I've been on plan in several days, like 10 days. So I feel kind of yucky, bloated. I was feeling it while I worked out, but I did it. I worked out, I feel great, food's good. Just gonna sip on my water, have my smart sweets, and that puts me at 21. I might have, I think I had 22 points technically because of the one point that I gained back from eating the green beans. But yeah, great day. I'm gonna go upstairs quickly, just do a body shower. I don't wash my hair. I almost, I wash my hair like probably twice a week, sometimes once a week, and I just wear hats and dry shampoo the crap out of my hair. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go upstairs, shower my body off, enjoy my smart sweets, and spend some time with my husband and watch some TV. So I hope everybody had a wonderful day. I hope you enjoyed this what I eat in a day, even though I like crammed all my food into the evening. Um, but I hope you enjoyed hanging out with me today. I thoroughly enjoyed being back and I will catch you very soon for the next one. Bye.